community of Baxter's in St. Andrew. You guys are getting the crayfish net ready as we're going crayfishing. How far are we going? Going far? How far are we going to go? So we're going to get some crayfish. When we come back, we're going to be in the bush catching the crayfish. So let's stay tuned. Log on to the CBC Morning Barbados. Crayfish, she and Cassandra. We got our crayfish. We're coming to the studio and show you the crayfish creole. I'm gonna make for you with oak and some dumplings. This is Barbados, beautiful Barbados, a beautiful Sunday evening. Good morning, Barbados. Join me in the studio. Morning, morning, morning. Good morning. I'm going to be doing another dance this morning. I could see it already as you get this crayfish uh, broth ready. Cassandra, good morning <laughs> to you. You know, when that voice comes, what happens? A dance followed, follows with here comes the food. Uh, so that is good. Where we want to go next here on Morning Barbados is uh, to delve into some of this sea. What were you calling this? A crayfish broth? Crayfish broth. Crayfish fish, broth. Crayfish creole broth. And apparently mm -hmm. there are some people that don't know that we have crayfish that you can find in Bajan So simple, ponds. so simple. Very, very simple. Uh -huh. And this is just a, we call this a gandhi. This is one here. Mm -hmm. The is gandhi? It? Yes. You know about this, uh, yes. Danel? That's what we call the crab um, part in Tobago. We call it the gandhi. The okay. size here, look. Mm -hmm. so, so Biggie, this was zesty claw. And this is the meat. 
What does look? It looks like a shrimp. It, it's probably to a shrimp. It, the difference between a prawn and a shrimp is the gills. Okay. Prawn carry gills. Shrimp don't carry gills. Mm. And so in the broth, I have. Let me just cover this down a little bit. Take my gloves off. Right. Get her tidy up a bit. Yeah, this is what the kitchen looks like. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and you brought back some melts too. Definitely, that's the added texture, a crunch to the dish. All right. Let's cover that for two minutes. Mm -hmm. So in here, you have pumpkin, edos, um, sweet potato, green banana, plantain, homemade dumplings, oh God, the crayfish, so flying fish in there as well, some ginger, some garlic, some, some chives. Good. I'm going to add some okra down to this. I'm releasing my jacket because of that. It's coming. <laughs> I, I cannot. I feel it. It's Cassandra vacation. She did yes, the Yes, she is. <laughs> I'm so happy because I get her portion. <laughs> Cassandra. I am. Um, I was sad at first uh, when she was telling me, you know, I, I not too long uh, return from my short holiday. And then you know, she's telling me that she's going on this extended sabbatical. But you know, it's times like these that you can really appreciate that. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate her taking that time <laughs> off. That time off. Yeah. Danella, they do anything like this in Tobago? I have never seen, no. We've never had, I've never had crayfish. Broth in before. Tobago? No. The crayfish is famous for the fish. The fish. Uh, Tobago? Yeah, the fish broth too as well. Oh yeah, our fish broth is good. Definitely. Yeah, have a fish broth. Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. It's amazing. Fat in those places I, I in Tobago. Oh, you, you, yeah. you know quite a lot of fish I, I spent yes. two years in Tobago, remember? I spent two years in Tobago opening the Mandina Grand. So right. okay. I love from Charlottesville go straight down to Crown Point. I love it. I All love it. It's very beautiful. At least Tobagonians here are morning about this. <laughs> you were talking about some left hand. Um you were oh rolling, my God. rolling the Dublin. <laughs> yes, Dublin. And so in Tobago. Um, they have a saying that when the ladies want to hook the a man, man you know, yes. hook their man, they yes. make it up with the left, left hand. hand. Correct. So you go by young lady, you have um, curry guana and dumplings, and she See? make it with your dumplings, you know? <laughs> curry guana. Curry? Iguana. Iguana. Correct. It's big. Yes. <laughs> Iguana and dumpling goes down really well. All right, you see, this is where. <laughs> See, what eat iguana? But you, you're familiar with Trinidad, though. Yeah, I love Trinidad. I know you love Trinidad. <laughs> <laughs> I do love Trinidad. Like. I, 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 I'm not eating no iguana. No, you're I'm not? I'm not eating no agouti. I'm not eating <laughs> no anything. No nothing. No, the sweetest meat. Like yes. a rat. The sweetest yes. meat. Sweet, yes. sweet. Who? Sweet. Something, they have something called harvest in Tobago. Mm -hmm. uh, it's absolutely beautiful. You yes, get it is. all types of world meat. Mm -hmm. Everybody's friendly. It's an yes. open village. Yes. You just watch everybody else. And eat. And eat. And have fun. Sounds familiar. <laughs> <laughs> But I like that. That, that, that is community spirit right there. You Definitely. walking into anyone's house, yes. mm -hmm. having a meal with them, you don't know them. That's the first time I ever ate iguana. It was at a harvest. In, How old um, did it taste? What do you compare it to? Oh, harvest. nice. Yeah. What do you compare it to? Iguana? Um, it's not comparable to anything. No? It has its own unique taste and yeah, texture. <laughs> and, and I'm expecting the same thing from this here. So, this, um, so this is, um, remember it's, it's crayfish, it cooks very quickly. Oh. Yeah. So we can start to plate up. The fish is looking awesome. Yes. You found fly fish again? Yeah. I had yeah. to pay for this though. Jeez. I had to pay. What was the price for the fly fish now? $35 for 10. Pardon? $35 Barbados dollars for 10 flying fish. Yep. The silence <laughs> says it all. <laughs> $35 for 10 flying fish. Correct. Wow. This is really 2020. Mm -hmm. I, could, I remember the price. Uh, about, I guess that's, to believe I could say two decades ago, that alone is amazing. Price two decades, two decades, you would probably get a hundred flat fish for $10. Definitely. Or for $20. Definitely. Wow. So yeah, but at least they're back. Most of the flat fish are down. Tobago. The now side. <laughs> down in Tobago. I actually my guys still going fish down there. You know, because uh, it, it, Legally? Oh. Um, you know, you know the funny thing about it. Uh, I have never seen flying fish on a restaurant menu in Trinidad or Tobago. No. Mm. Mm -mm. This is looking super awesome. It you've smells all, awesome. You've all done yourself today, uh, Chef. Adrian. So this is fresh from Barbados. Um, this is what we have in our all Beijing ingredients. All Beijing ingredients, and this is what we have in our in our country. This is what we have, and it's found in 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 the beautiful area of Barbados in the. How did you find Saint that part of St. Andrew? Let me my, my, my dad is from St. Simons. 
Okay. So I was going to say. these spoons are for? This, I, have, I, I was doing this big one for you. Uh, I had this small one for Cassandra, but. Cassandra's not here. I know. I'm not ready yet. Well, you're not ready yet. So to add contrast to this, I was mentioning my father's for a So uh -huh. I have a little bit of history in St. Andrew. Mm -hmm. And so for contrast on this um, broth, I'm going to add crispy. You eat melts? You know it's melts? She, know what she knows now. what rolls are. Yes. So I, uh, I was trying to like describe them for her. It's pretty close. Taste matters to me. The male reproductive organ. Oh. Uh, it's, it's oh. The rules of female. So you're getting the real deal now. You're getting the real deal. Yeah. The male. <laughs> <laughs> Let me clean off here. Y'all come and indulge in some of the uh, Asian history here. Wait, wait, wait. Where's her spoon? That one. Oh, this one is her spoon. Ah, uh, Sorry. That, awesome. Let me bring this here for you. Right. And this is what we have in Barbados. Dumb. Fresh caught yesterday, as you can see. My problem is always eating this crayfish, but okay. I will get into the broth first. And your right hand up there. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very hot. But it tastes real good, though. Mm. Yes, that's good. Oh, my goodness. That is definitely good. It's good food. Mm. Mm. Good, good food. This mm -hmm. is awesome. So I just want to show to you guys before we go. Mm -hmm. In Boxers in St. Andrew, thank you very much um, to all the Thank you very much. Um, <laughs> for bringing Cook Caribbean down in the river. As you can see, we have picked our own crayfish. It was fantastic, beautiful day. I will encourage all Barbadians to you know, love your culture, love your food. This is what we have here. And mm. this could be served internationally all around the world. It's really good though. Words can't describe. Yeah, it's good. Thank you, Cassandra. Thanks, Cassandra. No worries. Cassandra, <laughs> the role is here behind the camera. <laughs> You'll get a very special thank you very shortly. I'm saving the dish. That very special thank you is coming in a few seconds, but we really want to thank you for joining us. Sorry, Peter couldn't join us. She's allergic to this type of food. We'll see you bright and crispy tomorrow at 6.